everybody this is going to have to be a quick one we have this morning we have a um a little errand to run so i'm doing it earlier and i'm doing it a lot faster so if you don't know we're memorizing the book of jude together and we are going to be going over uh reviewing verse one and adding verse two today so this is day two and the procedure uh goes as follows good morning to everybody um Good morning, grace and peace to you all. Um, so we have an early we have an early morning errand to run this morning in our household. So I'm going to be doing it at six this morning instead of uh, seven. So uh, today we we're, we're trying to retain. So it's a retention phase, uh, and we're going to be retaining our our old verses. So we do those first. So um, we're going to try to um, remember the first verse, and that was. Uh, Good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, one, one. What I like to do is I like to read it once and then recite it. All right. Uh, I'm going to have to recite it 10 times, but I like to read it once just to get that mental picture back in from the previous day's verse. So it's one, one. Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to those who are called, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ. So now we, uh, we cover it up. And we try to, that's my, my phone, it's pretty old. All right, so we cover it up, 1-1. One, one. Memorize, yes, memorizing out of the ESV, yep. 1-1, yeah. um, one, one. Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to those who are called, and I always forget that, called beloved by God the Father and kept in Jesus Christ, and kept for Jesus Christ, okay, 1-1. One, one. So we're doing this 10 times. Number two, one, one, Jude, the servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to those who are called, uh, beloved by God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ. Is that it? Beloved in God the Father. Those prepositions, boy. One, uh, one, one, Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and, apost and a brother of James, to those who are called, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ. One, one. Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and a brother of James, to those who are called, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ. This is number five, one, one. Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to those who are called. Oops, that's my alarm. One, my snooze alarm. Like, hey, snooze, don't. Okay. Uh, to those who are called, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ, one one Jude, a servant of God, and I'm oh, sorry, <laughs> one one Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James. To those who are called, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ. Yes, warning, Bible, Bible, Bible. <laughs> one one Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James. Uh, to those who are called, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ, one, one, Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to those who are called, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ, one, one, Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to those who are called, uh, beloved in God the Father and kept for Jesus Christ, last time, one, one, Jude, a servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to those who are called, beloved in God the Father, and kept for Jesus Christ. All right, so we got our retention stage done. Okay, we retained verse 1. No no worries. Um, if you haven't perfectly retained it, it is, not, it is not about perfectly retaining it by day 2. It is, by, it's, it is about perfectly retaining it by day 70, by day 100, by day 125. Because you're going to say this verse 125 days straight. All right. So don't get frustrated if you haven't retained verse one perfectly and can't recall it from memory by day one or day two or day three or day 10. OK, uh, this is about long term retention. It's about saying your alphabet. Basically, this is like saying your alphabet for your entire life. Right. You'll be able to you can say your alphabet today with no problem. OK, because you said it when you were a kid numerous times over and over and over again okay um it's just like listening to your favorite song you'll rewind that track uh 
and you'll and you'll listen to that favorite song 20 and 30 times in a row which is really good right and then it's stuck in your head forever okay so there you know that's what this is about it's about getting it stuck in your head forever and this is the method so verse 2 we, we read it 10 times taking mental pictures of it and then we recite it 10 times uh, so one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you and I'm going to show you what I do this is my process um, and since I'm not broadcasting or simulcasting live I'm going to upload this version to um, so what I do is I have this tally counter app that helps me to uh, maybe if I there you go all right so as I'm memorizing whoo, that light that light though okay so as I'm memorizing I'm keeping the this is helping me to keep count all right so that's what I do all right so it helps me to keep count okay uh, so you'll see it down here at the bottom all right one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one last time one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you and then I reset and I do it and I recite it um, close the book you can close it you can do whatever I'll just do that I'll fold the page one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you one two may mercy peace and love be multiplied to you so that's your procedure for day two um, it's fairly fairly simple fairly easy uh, for the first two or three days uh, tomorrow we'll start um, retaining everything that we've learned so far and start reciting the book in order so that's it for uh, this morning I'm going to upload this to Facebook Facebook I'm not going to do a Facebook live at the same time this morning because of the, the nature of the hour uh, but grace and peace and may mercy peace and love be multiplied to all of you today in the Lord Jesus Christ all right